Since the moment I had learned of my illness, I have traveled the world in search of a cure, and I finally found it. The secret of life, it's hidden in a house. I only wish I knew what awaits me there. Ah, there you are. The Elder told me there'd be four healers. This is the man who summoned us. Contact him when you unload your carriage. Greetings! You're one of the healers, aren't you? Good. If you're able to help us, you'll get your reward. The secret of life. The ritual will start today, but we shouldn't discuss it here. The town isn't safe. I'll wait for you in the hotel. More healers? How many have to die before you're satisfied? You must stop this. Good, you're here. Like I said, the town isn't safe. We all want to conduct the ritual, but people are scared. They believe in curses. So if someone is rude to you, try not to be offended. Personally, I just want to save my daughter's soul. But I don't have to explain this to a healer, do I? The ritual will last three nights. You should prepare yourself first. Everything you need is in your room. Number three. Just... Don't enter any of the other rooms for any reason. You should hurry and collect all the ingredients you need. The moon has risen and the ritual will begin soon. Don't forget, you're in room number three. Look what I found in my room. My name is on it. I found one in my room, too. Well, that's it. I'm done. This isn't worth the reward. You're right. It's not safe in this town. Hello? I'm Lisa. My father owns this hotel. Have you come to save us? <laughs> oh, forgive my tears. Please, take this tray. My grandmother told me it could save a life during the ancient purification ritual. Put the ingredients you collect on the tray, and the silver will react to them. The elder is waiting at the square when you're finished. Where is she? Oh, thank God, she's not here. I thought that was the end of me. No reward is worth this. Spending three nights with her lurking around, I value my life too much. Here, I found this. It's connected to the ritual somehow, but I'm not sticking around to find out how. Maybe you'll be able to make use of it. Excellent. You're the first one to gather all of your ingredients. We must get to the gates to start the ritual, but there's one more thing you need. The heart, which opens the ritual book. It's hidden somewhere in town, but we aren't sure exactly where. I've been told you can get it using this crown somehow. Maybe you can puzzle it out. Here, as soon as you get the heart, I'll meet you at the gates. I knew you were the one to solve the secret of the crown, and I'm rarely wrong about people. Now you can head toward the house. We erased it from all maps in the world, trying to hide the curse, but we couldn't get rid of it. Hopefully, the purifying ritual will not only save my daughter's soul, but also the house itself. This map will help you find your way to the house, and this key will open it.
Congratulations! You made it through the first night. But you look a little pale. Why don't you go get some rest? There's a list of what you'll need for the second night in your room. Feel free to ask for help finding anything you need. The second night is even more dangerous. Now, let's be off. A nice soft bed awaits you. I'm so glad you're okay. This proves you're the one who can finally help us. Are you looking for the ritual book? It might be in the town library. If you're going there already, can you help me? I'm looking for a special cake recipe my grandmother used to use. She kept a copy in the library. If you find it, will you bring it to me? Thank you. Here, it's usually dark in the library. I'll wait near the hotel for you to come back. And this will help you get in. This is it. Thank you. Here, I found this in room 5. It belonged to the healer who was staying there. He was looking for the town librarian. Maybe it'll come in handy for you. Hello. Sorry, I can't see you without my glasses. Oh, yes, hello. You must be the healer who's working on the ritual. The last healer came here too. He was asking about things to help him with the ritual. It did to help him survive, though. Maybe you'll have better luck. These things are vital for the second night. One of Meryl's personal belongings and a piece of chalk. And take the metal ball, too. It'll help you get into the Elder's house to find something that belongs to Meryl. As for the chalk, I'm sure you'll find it somewhere. Ah, it's you. Preparing for the second night, eh? I was just thinking about my daughter. You were there in the house. Is she... Is she at peace? So, they were right. She is a witch. Please, purify her soul and bring her peace. You can search her room for anything you might need. This is part of the key. She once told me that Chappie guards the other piece. I'm not sure exactly what she meant. Chappie is a local dog who lives nearby. Hello! A healer, eh? Your predecessor came here too. He was looking for herbs to complete some kind of amulet. I assume you want the same? The herbs cost three coins. Thank you for your purchase. Here are the herbs you need. And good luck with the ritual. So, are you ready for the second night? Excellent! Good luck in there. I'll see you in the morning. Here. Ah, doesn't matter. But don't tell anyone you saw me here, for your own good. Me, Meryl, so this Volo sit anima to a peaceful. made it through the second night. I knew I was right about you. Your room is waiting for you, as usual. The list for the third night is there. Have good rest, my friend. Hello. It's so nice you're still here. I thought you'd leave us like the others. Sorry about all my crying. <laughs> it's my fiancé, Gavin. He's the librarian's grandson, you know. Anyway... We were both friends with Meryl, but then Gavin and I fell in love. <laughs> anyway, we had a fight today, and he stormed off. I'm worried he's in danger. I saw him going to the place where Meryl was. Killed. It's right behind the gates. Can you go make sure he's all right? Here, this brooch he presented me. It can help you enter the cursed territory, and the map will guide you to the place. God bless you, and may Gavin be okay. I see you're ready for the third night. Now, I feel like I can trust you. I'm hoping you can help me. I know that purifying Meryl's soul is the priority, but 
I need to know who did this to her. Will you investigate her death? Thank you. I'll open the gates now, so you can look around where her body was found. I'll be waiting at the house if you find anything. Kevin? But he was her friend! Thank you. I'll make him pay for what he did. The third night is the most important. There's a hidden room under the house. If you can get inside, you'll find the grail. Use it to purify my daughter. I'll come for you in the morning. Thank you, brave friend. Yes, I feel I can call you friend, even though we are strangers. Dark magic ruled my body, but you saved me. It's true, I used to play with magic. Maybe I deserve what happened to me, but not my father. Not the healers who suffered here. I know that now. But you saved my soul and this whole town. And at such a cost. You truly are selfless. Oh, that must be my father at the door. Go on, live your life, and try to keep your heart as pure as it is now. You did it. You saved her. All of us. Gavin was arrested. He's going to prison for a long time. And now Meryl is at peace. I can't believe it's finally over. May you be blessed for your sacrifice. And forgive me for not telling you about the side effects of the secret of life. I needed you to succeed. <laughs>